We all have that one game we will always come home to. We asked our community and here are the games we will never stop playing. Chill games. No matter how hardcore you are, you have at least one or a few chill games in your library that you come back to when the going gets tough or you simply want to wind down. Something about farming games just brings out the maximum coziness. And to add to that, the sense of community with the characters in these games will surely make you want to come back. Next up, we have open world games. With the world so vast, you can spend hundreds of hours playing in them. That's certainly true for games like Breath of the Wild, especially with all those Korok seeds to find. For PC open world games, the possibilities are even more endless. When you start getting bored of hunting down dragons in Skyrim, or you feel like stalling your search for your child in Fallout 4, there are so many community-created mods to spice things up. Of course, when talking about communities being creative with the hundreds of hours they spend playing these games, they can't forget about Minecraft. In this game, if you so choose, the whole world is your canvas. There are a few different kinds of multiplayer action games. But something in common in all of them is that they're so thrilling and fun to play that hopefully they never die. Hashtag save TF2. Games like Smash and Tekken release new characters every once in a while so you can try a new fighting style. And there's also the Monster Hunter series where you could take down huge monsters with your friends. With the new DLC out, it will be a long while before this game gets stale. And of course, MOBAs like Dota 2 and Mobile Legends will live on until the end of eternity. Here are all the other games you guys mentioned in our post. I'm actually shocked nobody mentioned The Sims. Anyways, let me know what you guys are playing for the rest of your lives in the comments below. This has been Rain from whattoplay.com, helping gamers find games.